show you what our butterflies are doing. Uh, they are enjoying the sunshine and all the nectar here. We also have our fruit dish that the butterflies love. Uh, Safeway donates this fruit. It's expired fruit and the butterflies love it and you can see they're enjoying it. If you can get really close up, let's see if we can do that. You can see the proboscis and that's how they're getting the, the fermented juices out of that is with their proboscis and they are enjoying that. Stay tuned. We're going to also do a butterfly release and show you an, a moth party happening today here in the conservatory. Hi everyone, this is Adrienne Grimaldi, Director of Education. We are going to do a daily dose of butterflies out in the conservatory today. We've got a couple things to share with you. We want to do a butterfly release. Uh, I just got kissed by a butterfly. Uh, we also want to show some uh, atlas moths that uh, have emerged and are out here. And a look. So we have 60 to 70 different species of tropical butterflies and these are going to be released brand new flight for the day. Check it out. We have African moon moth. We have a Julia right here. Uh, that was a paper kite. We have, what else do we have here? They're raring to go. They love sunshine. Butterflies are so with power. Uh, we have a malachite right here. Pretty cool. Why do you think? And we have another paper kite. Let's see if we can get him to come out. Here he comes. We have. There we go. Oh, very nice. Very nice. And one of my favorites is the Atala. And it's a small little butterfly. Let me see if I can find one here. This little guy right here is our smallest butterfly in the conservatory. Let's see if you can see it up close. He's going to take his flight. We have that little guy right there. Oh, we got a few more. One, two, three. Oh, a couple more. A couple more that are shy. This is a Julia right here. Let's go take a look at the atlas moths. If you, uh, we have our atlas moths that are kind of having a party here. And wanted to share with you, uh, we have the largest moth in the whole world. And this one right here is a female. Uh, the females get quite large. Um, females have a larger abdomen and uh, are usually larger. Uh, the males here have smaller abdomens. Check this guy out here. That is so cool. So if you look at the wingtips, uh, it looks like a snake head and it has see-through windows that blend into the bark of a tree. Only lives five to seven days because it does not have a mouth part. It is living off of its reserves as a caterpillar. So this is a boy and we have our girl right over here. And they're just uh, having a moth party here. 